If you didn't catch it, in episode 16, we delved into the intricate world of graphics settings. Are you on the brink of perfecting your simulator's performance, but yearn for that extra visual flair? What if I told you that there's a way to amplify the simulator's visuals and, at the same time, boost or at least maintain its performance? You might, rightfully so, think that I'm joking. But, having guided many in our community to harness their PC's full potential with the simulator's graphics settings, I could say it's absolutely possible. So stay tuned as we unveil the seemingly paradoxical approach to achieving unparalleled visual and performance excellence. Welcome to Nocturnal Simulations, where every week we bring you 90 seconds of tech tips, helping you maximize graphics and performance within Microsoft Flight Simulator, ensuring a smooth and stutter-free experience at a whole new level. Today's topic is about turning up GPU settings to increase CPU overhead. All right. For those of you who tuned in to episode 16, you're aware of the magic behind tweaking the level of detail settings. If you missed out, give it a quick peek. It's more gripping than a drama series finale. The quest? Keep that main thread time at rock bottom while creating the CPU overhead you need to banish stutters and elevate FPS to royalty status. Here's the twist though. Cranking up certain settings can be more beneficial than dialing them down. Mind blowing, right? Some settings on low won't actually boost your FPS. And in a turn of events, Pushing some settings to high shifts their workload from the CPU to the GPU. Imagine your CPU hustling away and that basic GPU is over there sipping its iced pumpkin spice latte, taking a chill pill. But worry not, if you've ever fallen into the Google rabbit hole searching for Microsoft Flight Simulator tips, come on, we've all been there, you'd have stumbled upon the treasure trove by the original Babu, hope I didn't butcher the name. If by some anomaly you haven't, check the link below. It's practically the simulator's holy grail for anything graphic performance related. Overflowing with data, this guide is like the North Star for those seeking the ideal balance. You'll want to focus on settings labeled no measurable impact to CPU performance, or those gentle on CPU like texture resolution. The gems in this list, we're talking volumetric clouds, lens flare, motion blur for the drama, depth of field, bloom, contact shadows, terrain shadows, grass and bushes, trees, and the whole shebang. The list is longer than my last grocery trip. So, fellow sim enthusiast, if you're cruising at medium to low settings, tighten those CPU settings, <clears throat> level of detail, and amp up GPU-centric ones. Witness your sim's visual spectacle soar, potentially with a sweet FPS bonus and smoother operation. And start that next flight with the visual spectacle the simulator is capable of. If you found this enlightening, smash that like button, subscribe, and spill your thoughts and results in the comments. Let's get this guide to all those craving that elusive blend of dazzle and excitement. And hey, if you're feeling generous, consider supporting the channel through the Buy Me A Coffee link or our trusty affiliate links below. Happy flying!